Hey y'all, it's Tracy with Mama's Comfort Cooking and it is Super Bowl Sunday. I am live. I am not competing with the Super Bowl, but I want to show you something that you can have ready before halftime. And that is buffalo chicken dip. So what I have done, y'all come on and let me just tell y'all, hey. And so what I've done is instead of buying the individual cans of chicken, I bought a rotisserie. It's cheaper. You get more meat. You pay so much more less money. So these are the ingredients that you would need to create this dish. First of all, you need chicken. Next, you're going to need Frank's buffalo sauce. Frank's buffalo sauce. You're going to need Parmesan cheese. You're going to need finely shredded mozzarella cheese. You're going to need a little sour cream. And, and here I have two 8-ounce Philadelphia cream cheese and also six slices of creamy Havarti. I've already stirred it up so it could be working really good. And what I did with the heavy cream, I added about a third a cup of heavy, heavy cream in that to loosen it up. So look, it's Super Bowl. And you don't want to miss anything, right? Right. So what we want to do is get started and show y'all how in 45 minutes you will have some amazing chicken buffalo dip. So first of all, I'm going to debone this rotisserie. I always let somebody help you do the work, and I did spray my pan. So what I'm going to do is just take it. You don't have to chop it. It doesn't have to be pretty. You just have to make sure when you get through that there is no bones and that we're going to go through it one more time, and we're going to shred it real, real, real good with our hands, okay? So I just did the breast, and yes, I'm going to use some dark meat. I'm going to use um, thighs, and I'm going to use legs. Whatever I can get. I took the skin off. Make sure y'all take the skin off. Is that all right? Yeah. See, there's a bone in there. So once we get all of it out, there's a couple of bones. We're going to go back through it and make sure that we don't see any bones in here. No bones about it. <laughs> y'all, we had a good time in church today. This again, for y those that's coming in, this is a buffalo chicken dip. I'm not using canned chicken. Go buy you a rotisserie. You'll get more meat out of it. Is that all right? Go get you some rotisserie chicken and just chop it up and you won't have to keep buying individual cans of chicken. Make sure I get all the meat off. We don't want to waste any meat. I removed all the skin. You don't want this part. You don't want the skin. So let's get all the meat off. And you don't want the fatty part. So, and we don't want any bones. And we want to shred it real good with our hands. Just crumble it up real good. How are y'all doing today? I hope y'all doing great. I am doing good. And I love y'all. Yes, I do. And I was so thankful today when we had church, honey, and the presence of the Lord was in the place. This was our first time in the sanctuary. No, uh, Pamela Brown, Pamela Proud, um, Mama Brown. No, um, I'm, I'm not using canned. You can use canned chicken, but you're going to spend so much money using that canned chicken, baby. Just get you a rotisserie chicken and shred it up like you see me doing. And you don't have to use no gloves. This is your food. I'm cooking in my house, y'all. Amen. Is that all right? I love y'all for your support and your understanding. I'm human. My feelings get hurt. I can be a crybaby. So look, I've shredded it up now with my hands. So why go buy it in a can? You're going to spend what? $3 each can when you spend $2.98 for a rotisserie. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to start adding the cream cheese in. And then I'm going to use the buffalo. I'm not going to put all the flavor just in the chicken. I want it to marry together. Is that all right? Good. So what I want to do is I want to go now. This is two Philadelphia cream cheese, eight ounces. And this is six creamy Harvari slices. I bought it in the slices. 
I put it in the microwave with a third cup of heavy whipping cream so I could work it real good. I really did. Okay. I want to get everything in there really good. I don't want nobody fussing over who didn't get no cheese. Okay. Next, what I'm going to do is add a little sour cream to mine. I love y'all. And y'all, I'm going to be baking this week. I'm going to be cooking. I feel my help. I come, I'm coming back. Uh, I know I shouldn't do that, but. So I'm going to put about two tablespoons of sour cream in here. That's all. Just working it up. Getting it good and rich and flavorful. Now with me, I don't add any salt. And the reason why is because the, the Frank's Buffalo sauce has salt in it. Okay? Now I'm going to start adding it. Now let me tell you, it's a cart. Now how much of this you use, so don't just go pull the whole bottle. Because if you don't want it too spicy, if you just dump all that in, then it's going to be too spicy for you if you don't like spicy food. So I would recommend you do it a little at a time. Is that all right? This is Parmesan cheese. I'm going to add a little Parmesan. And listen, go back and watch this video. This video is my recipe. All right? So I'm going to keep stirring. And you can taste it because it's your food to make sure you like what you're creating. Honey, can you open this um, pack for me and give me a... I got a napkin, but I just can't quite get my hands together to open stuff. Right here. Next, I'm going to add mozzarella cheese. I'm adding mozzarella cheese. Finely shredded. You don't want the thick kind. You want it. That's it. You want it finely shredded. Finely shredded. Mozzarella cheese. Get any brand. This is an off brand, okay? Hey, Mama Jackson. I love you so much, Queen Mother. You have a true place in my heart. And I got to bless you. Mm -hmm. Your birthday coming up. I need you to um, give me a call. I need a little cash out. Just something. With your name on it, mama. Okay. I get honor where honors do. I do have one mother. And then my aunt Florine is like my mother. But I got so many spiritual mothers. Honor and respect them, okay? So this is what we're looking at so far. Okay, um, Mama Tracy. So talk to me. Wonder if I want mine a little spicy. Well, let's add a little more buffalo sauce. Now, I'm only going to add a little bit more because Avery is going to eat this. But do you see I barely added some? So I'm going to take it back to that line right there. You see, that's enough for us. We don't like ours over, over, over spicy. Put your oven on 350. 350. Look, half time you'll be eating this with some chips and something to drink. Put the oven on 350. Do what I tell y'all. For 45 minutes. Who said that? Don, did you say that? Don Tomlady? Yeah. Oh, yeah, for 45 minutes. Am I serious? I'm serious. I am so serious. Tanya Amos, I am serious. That's all we need. Well, Mama Tracy, I want to taste it. Taste it. Everything is done in it. Yeah. What did you say? It's all right, Angela East. Your mama is with you in spirit. Do you know how we love God, but we can't see him? 
We got to believe that they are right. Their body is resting. It used to be an old blues song said, your body here with me, but your mind is on the other side of town. Well, their bodies might be in the grave, but their soul is not, their spirit is not trapped there. They are with the creator, honey. Mm. They are with the creator. Well, how do you know? Well, because the word of God said they get a glorified body. One that won't be sick no more. One that won't ache. So, I know we miss them. We do. We miss them. I miss my daddy. Oh, yes, I do. I'm trying to get y'all in so y'all won't say, Oh, Miss Tracy, I got to go. It's kickoff time. Okay? So, before I let you go, that's what it looks like. Yeah. And then we're going to top it off with this finely shredded mozzarella cheese. Okay? Finely shredded. And we're going to top it off with some more Parmesan cheese. You use as much cheese as you want to use. I'm using all of this. Because I love you. Yes, I do. I love you, God Almighty, this evening. So now, I got this just like I want it. Oh, Mama Tracy, let me see. Get closer. I'll get closer. Look at that. Look at that. It's ready to go in the oven. This is going in the garbage can. This is going in the sink. Take your stuff. Clean your station up. Put your lid on it. Wipe it down. And all you got to do... Is get ready for the game. As a matter of fact, it'll be ready before halftime. Unless you want to refrigerate it a little bit, then put it in before halftime. It only takes 45 minutes to do. This is chicken buffalo dip. Uh, it's very good. It's good to take to events. It's good to eat when you're just watching TV and you want to chill and you're not that hungry. It goes good with Rotel dip. And at this point, if you, what did you say? What did somebody say? Oh, could I add more to this? Yeah, if you wanted to. You could make it Southwestern. You could add some Southwestern seasoning. A can of Southwestern mix with black beans and corn. Mm -hmm. Could I add Rotel? It's your business, you can. Yes, yes, sir. And yes, ma'am. And yes, kids. And yes, teens. This is quick and this is easy. Create it. Take the basis and go with it. You might come back and say, Mom, Tracer, I added some spinach to mine. <laughs> I added some spinach in with that cream cheese. Y'all know I'm thinking now, right? Add some spinach in with this cream cheese. Oh, my goodness. And then work it all up with this chicken. And now it's all of a sudden become spinach chicken buffalo dip. For the person that likes their greens. I love you too, Deborah Dunbar. I do. I'm the cook and you're my friends. So it's it's Super Bowl Sunday. Some of y'all watch football. Some of you like me, the football watch me. But I want to see what halftime is doing. And this is just a good way. So I'm gonna put this in the oven for 45 minutes. I'm gonna take my bag of chips and we going to dip. That's what we're going to do. And we're going to enjoy it. And you don't have to use a hot thing. If you want to, you could. Put it on a cutting board so you don't burn anything. But dip you out what you want. You can do however you want. If you want more sour cream on top of yours, do it. Whatever you want. If you want to add any kind of thing on there. If you want to add the, the mixture of all the stuff you get for tacos or the onions and the tomatoes and the cilantro it's it's your dish after this just get the basis and don't go buy all those cans i use one rotisserie chicken just one so i spent two dollars and 98 cents the philadelphia cream cheese was on sale it was two for three dollars so that was a dollar and fifty the sour cream was a dollar and 18 cents because it's ingles brand I already had the heavy whipping cream. 
This was about $3 a bag. $3.88 a bag. And the Parmesan cheese was like 4 bucks. This is on sale this week. So it was $2 because you could get two for four. They know how to push stuff because they knew a lot of people would be cooking this dish. So again, you want, do you want me to tell you the ingredients one more time? I will. So I took the skin off and all the meat off this pole rotisserie bird. I shredded it up with my hands. In this bowl, I took two Philadelphia cream cheese. And I put six creamy Havartis in there. Put it in the microwave and start stirring it. Then I added a third cup of heavy whipping cream so I could loosen it even better. Then after I did that, y'all saw what I did next. So I used two tablespoons of sour cream. And what else? I use not even a half a bottle of Frank's buffalo sauce. So first I shredded, I sprayed my pan. I shredded my chicken up. And then over here, I put that mixture into the shredded chicken. Then I added the buffalo sauce, right? Okay. Then I started to add my finely shredded, make sure it's finely shredded mozzarella. And then I added my Parmesan, part of it. And then I added my buffalo sauce and worked it in really, really good. Then I topped it off with my finely shredded mozzarella and the remainder of my Parmesan cheese. The oven is on 350, 45 minutes. She yours. I did not add any salt and I did not add any pepper. If you think you want some, that's good. But because this buffalo sauce it's already going to have salt in it. So I didn't want to make it too salty. Plus, the chips got salt. So, that's, that's, other than me dropping stuff over here on the side. <laughs> that's it. So what I'm going to do is hand this off to my husband. And let him put it in the oven. Um, it's already set for 350. We're not waiting to have time. If we have some more left. We'll eat it at halftime, but we're getting ready to put it in now. Okay? You see it? I'm handing it off to my husband. Y'all, we had such a good church. And I thank everybody for buying a t-shirt. While I got a thousand people on here, please go over if you don't mind. And um, follow me on Instagram and on YouTube. Like my page and follow it. Please like my page as well. Because it says I got 30-something likes, but I got 120,000 followers here. Also, thank you for... No, you don't need an egg. Somebody asked me no, an egg. No, no egg is needed. Um, you got to understand, we can't put eggs in everything. You, you don't have to put eggs in everything. It's a dip. It's just a dip. Um, I don't know what the big dip is, but it's the dip. And anyway, please go buy t-shirts. I don't know when they're going to be done, but www.mamascomfortcooking.com. They come in black and white from a size small to a size 6X. Um, Y'all, it's something about being in the presence of the Lord. I feel so good. Sunday Joy, I feel so good. And also, um, I just want to let y'all know, thank you for all the people that gave me a dollar or more. They went to my cash app. I took that money and I went and bought the things that I need to cook for y'all this week. That meant so much to me. You would be surprised when you have people give you. And it blessed me so that I could go to the store and get what I need to cook this week. So I won't have to keep running in and out and in and out. The cookbook Patricia Gibbs would be out on uh, in March. Pre-orders will start after they finish the t-shirts. And um, so tomorrow, I'm going to make y'all a chocolate cake. Um, I'm trying to decide if I want to do it live for y'all. Because this cake only takes 35 minutes to cook. 35, 36. But it's a pound cake. And it's a good one. And then I'm going to top it with chocolate icing. 
Hey, Queen Sharon Love. Yeah. And so, um, I don't know what y'all plans are for tonight. I don't know if y'all hosting the Super Bowl party. But don't stay in that kitchen too long. Please don't. Also, this week, I'm going to be doing pig feet and white beans together. They'll be cooked together. Okay? That is going to be on the menu this week. Also, I'll be uploading a video showing y'all how I do my potato salad this week. Also, I got to make another cornbread tutorial for somebody. And I'm going to measure everything out. I'm just simply trying to make it simple for y'all, as simple as we can. Thank y'all so much. Y'all have been so kind. And y'all have been so good. Whatever my lot. God has taught us to say, it is well, 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 it is well with my soul. Yes, no matter your circumstances or your situation, you got to tell yourself it is well. I was getting the crumbs off of my hand. I was crumbling it up as I was talking to y'all. I was just taking my hands and doing it like this and getting all that cheese off of it. And as it fell, I just take it like this and wipe it up because I got to clean this station up. Whatever my life, whatever I have to deal with, God has told us to say. It is well, it is well with my soul. Honey, you better make sure your soul is well and that it's anchored. I love y'all. And if I offended anybody yesterday, I'm sorry. Forgive me. I'm human. I get tested. And some days it's just not as well as others. Amen. But I'm sorry. And forgive me. Now, if you choose to, you can. But if you don't, it's well with my soul. And, um, you know, God is just, he's just been so good. And today in church, it gave me a, a boost of energy. I mean, we had church and our pastor, um, he preached. And he just started in Genesis, the first chapter, verses one through three. And we know in the beginning, God created the heavens and earth. We got to start with the structure. Mm -hmm. Just right there. In the beginning. In the beginning. So I got a confirmation to say we're just beginning. We're just beginning. And I know we have each been down this road a time or two. It used to be an old song that says we're just beginning. And I know we've each been down this road a time or two. Never could make it through. But I've got this feeling that we stumbled into what we've both been waiting for. <laughs> and maybe even more. But it doesn't matter where we've been Cause this time I know for sure We're going all the way We're headed for tomorrow And that's where I'm gonna stay The more the merrier The more I got it We got it all here If we just don't stop we're headed for tomorrow. Tell them I'm on the phone, Kelby. And that's where we're going to stay. The more the merrier, the more I know it. We got it all here if we just don't blow it. And the Lord gave me that confirmation because I can't convert over to something I'm not. I'm a giver and I love and I believe in giving. So y'all... That dip is easy, and it's good. And I know y'all got to go watch the Super Bowl. And I know any other time we will be having church. Yeah, so tomorrow we're going to have the after effects of church. Is that all right? Is that all right? Huh? Hey, 
Benita Gray. How you, girl? And I love y'all. Yes, I do. I thank y'all for your support and your kindness. Y'all, um, I was just blown over. My phone, them the dollars was ding, 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 ding. That's what it felt like Christmas. Jingle bell, jingle bell, ding, ding, ding. I said, thank you, Lord. But he just been so good. He been that good. And I don't have to worry. Because falling in love with Jesus was the best thing I ever done. And you know what? Can I tell y'all one more thing before I go? It's coming out in March, uh, Miss Darlene Hill. It's coming out in March. He saw the best in me. When everyone else around could only see the worst in me. Can I get a witness? Cause he saw the best in me. When everyone else around could only see the worst in me. I'm his, he's mine. It doesn't matter what I did. He only sees me for who I am. I have to wait till I finish, Kelly. Hmm? He's mine. I'm his. It doesn't matter what I did. He only sees me for who I am. Cause he saw the best in me. You want to help me sing that? I don't think he told me to end it. When everyone else around could only see the worst in me. Can I get a witness? Have anybody went through that? He saw the best in me. When everyone else around only wanted to talk about me. <laughs> Woo! Hallelujah. He saw the best in me. Write that down. When everyone else around could only see the worst in me. Well, he's mine. I'm his. It doesn't matter what I did. It doesn't matter what you did. He only sees me for who I am. He's mine and I'm his. It doesn't matter what I did. It doesn't matter what you did. He only sees you for who you are. And he sees the best in you. The best. He sees the best. And I am just, um, come on. I had to tell you all that I hope that you are having a most amazing and awesome Sunday. I hope you liked yourself first. L-Y-F-E. Put God first and love yourself first every day. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So the t-shirts are life, L-Y-F-E, love yourself first every day. It comes in black and white. Y'all, I like my little shirt I got on today. See that? It go all the way down in the back. It's long. What? Um, love yourself first every day. The other t-shirt is I love you. Yes, I do. And it's got a heart on it. And the other one says, honey, honey. And it's got a heart on the eye. You can go to www.mamascomfortcooking.com and you can order that shirt today. That's going to be the same website that I'm going to put up my yummies. That is what my ministry is at church. My soul products, I call them yummies. Mm -hmm. They yummy for your tummy. So, um, yummies will be sold there. Um, care the little packages that I'm going to put together. My um, sauce. I'll show y'all some of my sauces. I'm working on the sauce tomorrow. 
so I show it to you. Hey, Sheila Johnson Stevenson, I love you. Cousin Sheila, I do. I love you. You're my favorite in that family. I love you. Yes, I do. Beautiful as you are, I love you. I'm the cook and you're my cousin. <laughs> I love you, Sheila. Sheila, I'm doing a precious memory book. Do you have a recipe? I have one of Auntie Peggy's recipes, but <laughs> if you want me to put her in the book with a picture of her and a recipe, she is a part of my life. I love my aunt. I don't even want to saw it because I cry. Yeah, that's right back the end. It's precious memories. You let me know. You call me. Okay, y'all got to get ready for the Super Bowl. Y'all have got to go get out the parking lot. Pastor got out of church early. Everybody ready for the Super Bowl. They got their t-shirts. And y'all want to stay in the parking lot. Ah, we can't stay in the parking lot. We got to get ready to go. Because y'all do realize I only have a good 20 minutes left on my dip coming out the oven. Mm -hmm. That's it. So I don't know what's going on, but what I do know is <laughs> I'm going to be scooping. And I'm going to scoop hard. The shirts, you can order them right there. And somebody asked me the question, said, what if I don't have PayPal? And what if I don't have um, Cash App? Can I mail it to you? Yes, you can. You can mail it in for your cookbook or orders. You have to put your cookbook. Um, it's for the cookbook. When I find out the price, give me your address and everything so that I can make sure that it gets put in with the rest of them and get mailed off from here. Because I will order some so I can personally mail off, but I do have it um, attached to where you can just go in again and order your cookbook like you're doing now, and that'll just be the end of that. What's that? Yes, I didn't post my um, cash app, but um, it is um, the same thing. Everything is Mama's Comfort Cooking. You can reach me at www.mamascomfortcooking.com that's my website www.mamascomfortcooking.com is the website my email is www.mamascomfortcooking at gmail.com my cash app is the dollar sign mama's comfort cooking that's it that's it I thank you for your dollars they went a good distance today and now I can bake a cake because y'all know my cakes take a lot of eggs. Somebody said, you leave your eggs out? Not long. Not long. As many eggs as you have to use. Um, I got a taste of some old tiny food. Like real old. I don't know if y'all ever had um, pigtails and white beans, great northerns together. But you'll see it. And it's very good. Mama's Joyce, oh, Mama Joyce coming home tomorrow. Celine, thank you for that report. I had been trying to reach Marshall, and I called him, but you know, I kept saying, well, maybe he's um, preoccupied with his mom, because we don't never know. But to God be glory for that. The cookbook is going to come out, uh, Miss uh, Bernadette Thomas in um, March, and I don't know, my publication and stuff is working on it. Y'all, the cookbook is going to have big font. I made sure that they put it in big font. So we don't have to do like this. I'm excited about that. We need big font now. That was one thing I said. I said, I don't want anybody struggling to read the, in, the instructions and everything. And I was a little worked up yesterday. And I know I was like, I ain't going to put that heavenly pound cake in there. But you have to be true to your word. And I said I was going to do that. So I got to be true to what I say it. What's that? It's going to be the feature anyway. It's going to be the feature. And I'm breaking down that little technical very easy. Because some people say. Um, so. I'm sorry about that. I keep getting a phone call. I have to keep walking on it. Yeah. So. Anyway y'all. That's what I was going to tell you. My train of thought had just left. So, I can't remember. But it's going to be in big fun. And thank y'all. And I want y'all to get y'all t-shirts. So that, um, I want y'all to get y'all t-shirts. 
I'm getting so distracted. That's how the enemy will do. I, I'm getting so distracted, y'all. My family is there. Avery, shut the door. Um, let me end this live because that's what I got to do. It's real life, and I'm sorry. My thoughts keep getting taken from my head. But what I was going to say, I can't remember. And I apologize. But, oh, get your shirts. I want you to get your shirts because we're going to wear them. And I, I want you to have them because one day I hope to meet. And we eat and we break bread and we talk. Um, again, 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 I'm not going to answer the inboxes because I feel like people are deliberately inboxing me and asking me for a recipe. And I think if you were watching my videos, we had covered that. Um, yes, I'm Patricia Gibbs. I'm not shipping out anything until the post office get caught up. Because I don't want anybody's edibles to be. Are the shirts sold out already? I will go and call and see. I don't know. Nobody told me. I will ask and see if they can put it up for one day. If they're so out, who wants me to see if they will put them up for one more day? If y'all want me to put them up for one more day, say, say uh, yes. So I can see if they will. When did they get sold out? Okay, Sonya. I'm going to call um, them. See, they give me a limited amount, but I'm going to see if we can extend it a little bit more. But now, if I call and they can extend it, you're going to have to go over it immediately. Because that's one thing about other people doing stuff. You don't control what they do. My hand, I only came up with the designs. Oh, Marsha, Miss Marsha, you better stick around because tomorrow we're going to eat good in country. I do. I've been craving this meal and I'm going to cook it. Let me go. You go to www.mamascomfortcooking.com. The shirts go from a small to a 6X. But they said it was sold out. So I'm going to see if they would give me one more day. I, I wasn't aware of that. I knew it was getting close. They kept saying, uh, you're getting close to being sold out. But I don't know. I'll work on that. Jesus. 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 There is something about that name master savior jesus kelby like the fragrance after the rain hey kelby i'm gonna check that real quick tell her to come check this for me jesus jesus i just want to check the um dip Jesus, let heaven and earth proclaim. It's my dip. It's chicken buffalo. I just want you to check it. Hold it and get the things and take it out. Let me see how far we've come. It, does it look like it's melting pretty good? Kings and kingdoms. It's on the door of the stove. They will she always left. be the same, but there's something about that name. How's it looking? Hold on, let me see. Let me get these oven gloves and go get it, y'all. Hold on. You want, you want them to see you? No. Okay. I mean, I can just sit. No, you can't sit on my glass. Hold on. I'm going to get it a little more golden. But you could dip that. 
Let me give it a few more minutes. Give it the rest of the time, about 15 more minutes. I wanted y'all to see it. But if y'all gotta go, I snap a picture. I will call them about it and check on those t-shirts. I'll come live and tell y'all that um, for one day only or however many days they give me to order your shirts. You know what? Those are oven gloves. My husband brings me stuff all the time. And you can really hold stuff in there. Because it's, it's designed for you not to get burned. Jackie Waters, you don't have to worry. And don't you be afraid. Joy comes in the morning. Troubles, they don't last always. For there's a friend named Jesus who will wipe your tears away. And if your heart's been broken, just lift your voice and sing. Oh, I know that I can make it. I know that I can stand And no matter what may come my way My life is in your hands With Jesus I can make it With Him I know I can stand And no matter what May come my way. My life is in his hands. And no matter what may come your way, our lives is in his hands. I sung that because that's what the Lord told me. Don't worry. Don't overdo it. If I brought you to it, hey, Rosemary Turner, I see you through it. Hey, Mother of Bertha Dotson, I love you. And so no matter what comes our way, obstacles and sorrows, our life is in his hand. Yeah, somebody needed to really hear that. I know you did. I needed to hear it. It's Confirmation Sunday. Do y'all realize God is going to start confirming some things we've been praying over? We don't have to be redundant. You can say, yeah, but you didn't call this out and you didn't call diabetes out. I don't have to. We already done put it in the atmosphere. We've always made, already made our request known to God. We got to leave it there. We got to trust and obey. Mm -hmm. That's what we have to do. And whatever the outcome is, it's not me that make the decision it's him that makes the decision and if he said that she had to go to glory she had to go her works was done here what he had for her to do here was done like you putting yourself down and feeling like you didn't achieve what you thought you should have achieved that's not right you are who you are. I am. This is the song I'm going to sing before I close. Because I'm going to check it and let y'all see. I scoop it a little early. It'll be alright. But I need to tell somebody this. Um, I, it's, it's a certain people names. When they come across. I need to say it. 
But I am who I am, am today. Because God used my mistakes. He worked them for my good. Like no one else ever could. He told me to tell you today it was necessary. Mm, all the things I went through, it made me. So I am who I am today. I may not have everything because God used my mistake. He worked them for my good like no one else ever could. He told me to tell you today. He told me he's always making a way. He told me to tell you today it was necessary it was necessary y'all when people ask the same question over and over because they haven't been on can some of y'all grab those and let them know that again the cookbook and the price has not been given to me from publication they say they're going to launch that cookbook in March. But just, I don't want nobody to think I'm ignoring them. But it's necessary. What we, I had to get COVID for a reason. He allowed me to remain here. But it was necessary. One, it let me know just like that. Just like that you can be taken. So you better examine your life. The Bible says let a man examine himself you start trying to tell somebody what they doing you might miss something so I had to make sure my soul was anchored mm -hmm. I had to and I know y'all don't want to hear it and I know some people say lady just cook but that ain't how this pro that ain't how this page gonna go However, he shift me. He first. Because if I can't say another word, uh, Yvonne Ward, I got to get you some cake and yummies over there. Because I love you, Cecil. If I can't say another word, if I can't say another word, I'll just wait my hand and if i don't wake up in the come on baptist people morning oh lord if i don't wake up in the morning if i don't wake up in the morning everything gonna be all 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 right what you know about Jesus, oh Lord. What you know about Jesus. What you know about Jesus. He's all, he's all, all right. So if I can't say another word. Y'all know how the church songs say, if I can't say another, y'all say, word, if I can't say another word, I'll just wait my Okay, so I'm going to cut this short so y'all can see the outcome, okay? I'm about to open up the deal. Kelvin, I'm about to show y'all. Can you come here? How 
how it's going to dip and how we're going to eat it. And y'all know we got to do the benediction. Uh, who doing the announcements? Deborah Newberry Earl, I'm glad you asked. The announcements are as follows. Give it unto God and welcome to the house of God where there is no religious barriers. The announcement are, is as follows. The cookbook will come out in March. That is the launching of the cookbook. They will take pre-orders. Um, Tracy Mitchell, the owner of, Ma of Mama's Comfort Cooking, will call marketing to see if they can extend the t-shirts. You can get the t-shirts at www.mamascomfortcooking.com. They come in black and white, sizes small to 6X, $32.99. That includes shipping, and that also includes taxes. Yeah, you also can email Tracy at mamascomfortcooking at gmail.com. Mm -hmm. If you want to be a blessing, and if you want to give, you also can give dollar sign Mama's Comfort Cooking or you can do it on PayPal. If you're going to give begrudgingly, um, Mama Tracy, the administrator, says keep it and let's keep praising God. Uh, so as much as a dollar, a dollar, a make Mama Tracy holler. That is all the announcements that I have. Kelby! Let's govern ourselves accordingly. Is that all right with you all? So we can ready to dismiss. So we're going to put those gloves on. And my baby girl, we're going to taste it Mommy, real quick. And let y'all enjoy the Super Bowl. Mommy, guess what? We were playing a okay, Fula Okay, so you're gonna say, we're going to say out loud for everybody to hear it on the page. They'll hear everything. So we can talk about this when we get out. What you love me? Um, Kelby, um, Daddy and me were, um, eating by the foot, and Daddy beat me. Well, then you do another one. Wait, hold on, stop. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Here we go. She's gonna come around. There it is. Oh, there it is. <laughs> We're going to break into this thing. It's hot, girl. Ooh, she's nice. Ooh, wee. I want some of that. You want some of that? One more time, let me see. It's sizzling. It's your hot. It's hot, y'all. Mmm. Ooh. Ooh. Did Ooh. it burn your mouth? Ooh. Burn your mouth? <laughs> <laughs> And it's done. Just like that. Your chicken buffalo dip. <laughs> you can do whatever you want to do. You can add more. You can create your own. You can turn it into Southwestern. What is this? It's just the basis. So with that, all mine clear. If you didn't see it from the beginning, go back and watch it. You bringing me one more dip, sis? No. <laughs> oh, I thought I was going to get one more dip. You know, when I dip, we dip, you dip. Hey, I want some too. Ooh. Ooh, don't burn me. Ooh, honey. Wait, wait. It's too hot. This gonna be some. I want some of the chip. Hey, hey. Hold on. Excited. Is it good? It's a good taste to it, but it's okay. It's okay? Mm-hmm. You want more? Honey? Mm-hmm. Yeah, this is good. Ooh, look at that. Ooh. Mommy, I just know it's Make right. Make sure you blow it. I don't know it's right here. But okay, but wait a minute. Just taste that. Oh, oh, it did hurt. Go back and watch it from the beginning. I love you, too, and Brian Melton. I love you, Cecil. Okay, y'all. It's really live, Cecil. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All minds clear. Barbara wow. Williams, Jackson, y'all go back. It's too much comfort cooking. I'm sorry, baby. It might not be the station or the 
person to watch. Yeah, because we're not going to just bake cakes over here. Mm -mm. We're cooking pig feet and pigtails and neck bones. So, this comfort cooking with some soul. But thank you for watching this time. I love you too, B. Denise Warren. So, let's get ready and go home. I love you, Ro James, I do. I love you, Kim Hill, I do. I love you, Gail Smith, I do. I love you, I'm the cook and you're my friends. Bring the bones, I love you. Yes, I do. I love y'all. Thank God Almighty this evening. Come on and let's watch out. Come help me, Avery. May the Lord watch between me and thee. Walk. While we are absent, one from another, in Jesus' name, amen. Now go get out the parking lot because I got.